joining us tonight on the sideline. It'll be the visiting team taking on the Washington Wizards. It'll be the Wizards off the tip. Now the starting group for the visitors. They've got Dwayne Wade. Anthony Davis is out there with Chris Bosh. And it's Kyrie Irving. And it's LeBron with the three spot. And he's not going to miss that sort of an opportunity from deep. Inside. Here's Bosh. Yes. And it's Irving picking up the assist. And you know, Chris Bosh is so skilled, Kevin, close to the bucket. Get him the ball and he'll find a way to score. Chenier with the pass to Hayes. Sends it back. Wade, right side. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. And the confidence and the flair that Wade plays with, uniquely his own, a dynamite two guard who is also a clutch performer. And he makes the first. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. Looking at Washington, they took the win in their last game out against the Trailblazers in Portland. Here's the pass to Arenas. And just over a minute played here in the start of the game. Great tee that time from Davis. Here's Wade. And the layup's good off the glass. Hey, you gotta like the touch there from Wade inside. A polished interior scorer who knows how to get to his sweet spot. Here is Arenas. Passes to Hayes. Back to Arenas. Makes it off the glass. And once he got to the 10, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. This early, they should be showing a lot more energy on defense. It's not there. And Davis gets it to go. As dangerous as he is inside, Davis gives opponents nightmares when he's able to get to the mid range. He's very reliable when he steps back and takes the jump shot. Here's shooting. That shot missing. Wade with the defensive effort. And Bosch gets it to go on the assist by James. And it just seems that every pass they make is leading to a score. Just great ball movement. Here's Chenier, covered by Irving. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. That's on LeBron James. Washington shooting their initial free throws of the game right here. And so he hits both. Here's Wade. Irving looking over the floor. Pass to Bosch. Back to James. On loads. But they recovered. Shots good by Bosch. Bosch has got six. And, and Bosch has a beautiful stroke from the mid range. Once you give him room to shoot, he doesn't hesitate. Arenas passes to Shinny. Gets the three pointer to fall. Well, he is looking confident. Love how they're using him so far. And you know what? They're going to keep using him. I mean, he'll be the centerpiece of their offense today. You can bank on that. Irving misses. Washington free. One-on-one, -on -one fast break. Hey, guys, I'm starting to be concerned that the rim ain't going to survive some of these unsell jams. There's just so much power to his game. LeBron kicks to Bosch. It's rebounded by Enzo. But you can't look at the result of that shot. They'll take that and they're going to get it. You know, I hear you. That's a good look. But when you're that wide open, I think you got to knock it down. And how about the communication between teammates on that alley -oop? And that's what you need to pull that thing off. Boy, both ends of that play, guys, were fantastic. And a chance now to see how teams are faring across the league. Here's the latest edition of the Power Rankings. Look at the Lakers. They ascend up the list to number three with some spirited play. When you look at this visiting team, they've done exactly what they set out to do. Start strong, position yourself early, and then make everyone believe you're a championship contender. He does not lack for confidence. 
He should. I mean, this guy is a dangerous goal. From deep arenas, it's rebounded by Bosch. And close to making the defense pay for the lax coverage that time. Now on the scoring column with that bucket, it's one for two this game. The bronze game has a real shine to it. Spit pops. And he's got a great feel of when to attack from there. Here's Chenier. Eight points for him. Doesn't go for him. Great D that time from Davis. Irving finds James. Now Wade lets the three fly. James looking it over. Here's Davis. And that one comes up a bit short. I love the anticipation defensively there to get into the perfect spot. And Davis sends it back. I'll tell you what, Davis uses his move so well. I mean, a defensive stalwart who holds his ground. And because of his timing and length and athleticism, he's an excellent shot blocker. And here's Irving. Gilbert Arenas getting it to go from deep. LeBron, good. And an eye for an eye. Both teams working to stretch the floor. Nothing like answering back. One team gets three, you fire three of your own. Boom. So timeout called here, the first for Washington. Now let's go to the sideline and catch up with our Hall of Famer, David Aldridge. Well, thanks, Kevin. The Wizards head coach did talk to me a few minutes ago. Facing one of the game's truly elite players in Anthony Davis, he said, an all-around player, he'll find a way to affect the game. We've got to build a wall, force him to be a playmaker. Kevin, back to you. Thank you, David. Monroe's checked in for Washington. John Wall comes in for Gilbert Arenas. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. And you all may have heard this before, but I can't resist this fun fact about Kevin Love. His uncle was one of the founding members of the band The Beach Boys. Both free throws, good from Love. Well, he's certainly been on target with the free throws. Such an advantage when your bigs can knock them down from the line. Wall, no luck. Rondo passes to Cork. Knocks down the three ball. Perfect shooting form from K Square. Kyle Cork. Man, is he a laser. Quick release and always gets himself squared up for the look. Outside, Jamison. Pass to Monroe. And they get it. Gets it to go from beyond the up. Ball distribution is there. I mean, outstanding work all the way around. Outside, Corver. Love against Weber. Corver kicks to LeBron. Just find the shoot. Good D by Weber. Just doing the job on the back end. They sure are. I mean, they've done a terrific job carving out space under the basket and then pursuing the ball. You know, it's one thing to box out. You've got to pursue the ball if you're going to get rebounds on they look strong here in the early going. Yeah, Rondo just working the ball around there. He loves finding his teammates when they're open in the sweet spots. Corver against Monroe. Shot from 16. Here's Weber. The shot will not fall. Good tee by Love. Here's LeBron. And James throws it down play better defense than that guys I mean but right there James simply overpowered it. Wizards trail by nine Monroe outside now the pass to James now here is Weber passes it to Monroe the teardrop falls in Monroe's got five the shake and bake moves of Earl the Pearl. I mean, a phenomenal ball handler who just kills you with that change of pace. Now here's Love. The rebound by Chris Webber. Outside, Jamison. To the paint. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. That one on Love. 
and how unique is Weber? A smooth shooting big man with some sick handles. So he can't get either to fall. Here's James. Looks good, is good. Bucket number four from the field. He's taken only six shots. And the story here, Kevin, early on is how well they shot the basketball. Very high percentage so far. And if you want to start a game hot, that's the way to do it. Horford gets a wide open look. A chance to extend the lead to double digits, but it's no good. Here's Wall. LeBron with the block. This is what makes LeBron so special. He does it at both ends. Great tenacity on defense. Okay, Allen has checked in for Kyle Corp. Malone kicks to Jameson. Monroe outside. But they get a hit. Malone. And three chances on that possession. But they just couldn't find a way to score. Here's Allen. And it's Allen with the jam. Their focus coming in, terrific execution so far. And you know it's an all-out effort they've come in with. Very aggressive offense so far. Now here is Monroe. Five points in the game. Jamison kicks to Wall. Pass to Malone. Six to shoot. And that comes off the assist by John Wall. Yeah, you know John Wall is so masterful as a floor general. He's a real throw out there. Terrific at finding the open guy on time and on target. And they double up LeBron. Kicks it out to Allen. Rob trying to break loose. Hey Allen and that's good. Allen's got five. And they are shooting the lights out from distance here early. How do you stop this? I mean it seems like they can't miss. To the middle. Here's Malone. And Thompson sends it back. Rondo wide open. And he got that one up and Already a double-digit lead. The away team, they lead by 11. And don't go away. We'll be back with the action for the start of the second quarter in just a moment. And glad to have you with us, folks. Second quarter of basketball. This game has not exactly been neck and neck, but plenty of time left in this one. And looking at what we've seen so far, guys, from the visiting team, what do you think? They came in on a mission. Razor sharp offensive performance so far. I mean, the shots have been falling. They're making good decisions. That's a nice recipe there. Antoine Jameson out there with Weber. Then there's Monroe. Then it's Malone. And it's Wall in a point guard. That's the group on the floor right now for Washington. And Monroe kicks to Wall. Weber against Love. And stolen by Love. Allen outside. Wade left side. good on the way. Wade's got his second bucket of the game to go. And they're forcing the ball inside and it's working like a charm. Ball passes to Malone. Here's Monroe. And Davis pulls it down. And not allowing the shooter even an inch of breathing room on that one. And guys, that's exactly the kind of high impact defense they want to see out of him. Now, here is Monroe. After Dwayne Wade's miss. Shifty ball handler with a quick first step, and he loves to make things happen. Pass to Love. And a wide open hook for Irving. Good on the triple. Irving's got six points. Unwilling to let up even for a moment. That's his killer instinct, just fanning the flames. Yeah, I love the fact he doesn't play the score. He just keeps coming, attack mode. He doesn't know how to step off the gas pedal. And Malone, a high percentage score when he gets it in deep. Once he's got the defense on his back, the game becomes easy. And Washington going with a whole new group here. Allen for three. No good that time. Some solid defense from Butler. 
catch up with our sideline reporter, David Alden. Well, Kevin, over the last few years, there's been a lot of talk about seeding playoff teams 1 through 16, regardless of conference. Now, taking the top 16 teams is a tough sell, especially for owners whose teams are in the relatively weaker Eastern Conference. Taking eight teams from each conference and then cross-seeding earlier than the finals is something that does seem possible down the road. The reward for fans might be a finals matchup with the two best teams in the league. Kevin? Interesting ideas, David, thank you. And it's slammed in by Davis. Just so resourceful as a player. Davis gets the job done inside in all sorts of ways. And that's one of them right there, crashing the offensive glass, getting that second chance bucket. Now here's Arenas. He has five. Yep, it counts. Just a late reaction there from the defense, and he is always going to finish that. Wade finds in. Goes back up. Bosch, that's good. He's got eight. Solid rebound there, and with the score like it is, that's an area where they can't afford to get lazy. Yeah, another column in the stat sheet that hasn't gone in their favor. To climb back, they've got to put forth more effort. Now, here's Wink. He has six. Good work defensively by Arenas. You know, he looks a little off-kilter to me this quarter, still trying to find his rhythm. Chenier, the pass to Arenas. And he lobs it up toward the rim, stolen by Bosch. Here's Davis. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. Davis is really second free throw. And here in the second quarter of action, as we approach four minutes played, Arenas passes to Hayes. The pass to Shanine. Now Hayes. Six on the shot clock. Pass to Shanine. Carries the long range jumper. Shanine's got 11. against James. The kick out to Irving. Oh, good with the triple. And there's the call on James. That'll be his second foul of the game. Mark, you and I are amazed at how the global interest of the NBA has just gone through the roof. Or the league has made a lot of right moves, I think, in this area. They sure have, Kevin. I couldn't agree with you more. I mean, the international reach through what coaches in this country have done in teaching the game and promoting the game, not just coaches, but players as well. I think there's something about the game of basketball that just really transcends cultures, the pace of the game, the personality of the players, the creativity of the game. All of that lends itself to being so popular globally. Now here's Arenas. explosive scores in the game. The shoot first point guard who will let it fly at any time and do real damage with the ball in his hand. And he's good on the second. They've sheared the load offensively. And guys, they put the defense on their heels. You can see right now they're trying to react. And that's what you want when you're in a rhythm offensively. Now here's James. Nine points in the game so far. And out of bounds as the Wizards gain possession. Here's a look at what's coming up for Washington on Saturday. They'll tip it off. Road trip beginning in Oklahoma City where they'll take on the Thunder. Then on Sunday, they'll go back home and will be hosting the Orlando Magic. Here's Arenas. He has six. Irving drives in. Here's Davis. That one a little long. I'll tell you what, that is a missed opportunity for mid-range for sure with as little defense as was shown. Should have made that they grabbed their own miss. Here's Hayes. Pass to Onzo. Davis with the double team. Tries again. And Davis sends it back. And they get it back. Two on the clock. The lead now in single digits. Eight points for Gilbert Arenas. Sensational ball movement there. When you pass the ball like that, good things happen. And Eric Spolstra wants a timeout. 
things not going their way, and he wants to just try to talk this one over. And you know what, guys? If for nothing else, just to slow things down a little bit, change it up somewhat. Arenas has gone three for five from the field. Here's Caruso. He's covered by Arenas. And there's the foul. Here we go and Alex Caruso. That'll be his second foul of the game. And the next one puts him in the bonus. Yep, they'll be trying to draw that next foul quickly so they can start getting those easy chances at the strike. Here's Unsell. Pass to Shanine. Here's Unsell. Rondo with the foul. That's his first foul of the game, and the bonus will go to the free throw line. 
For Washington, they had made seven free throws in this three in this game. Hard not to appreciate the brilliance of Wall. I mean, a super fast, quick player. A guy who runs the offense exceedingly well. Moses Malone. He's checked in for Washington. Irving against Wall. Irving passes to LeBron. Good, and the assist goes to Irving. Irving's got his fourth assist in this one. Another one of those special nights for LeBron. I mean, you know, if he sticks around till he's an older fella, that all-time scoring career mark, wow, might be in jeopardy. Out to the right wing. Here's Monroe. And again, Washington, no good. Boy, defense non-existent there. But they catch a break as he whiffs it. Unzelled the pass to Walton. Over Irving, he hits the back iron and sinks the shot. And the Wall's done a nice job, in my opinion, of improving his mechanics with his shot. It's not quite a pure release, but much, much better than it was a couple of seasons ago. And he's really become effective from the mid-range area. Here's LeBron, and he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. This is his second trip to the free throw line. He misses the free throw Amongst the many things that I appreciate most about LeBron James, and there are a lot, his leadership. I mean, everybody else just kind of naturally falls into place behind him because he's such a good example and a positive leader. Wall wide open, and he's good on the three ball. Wall's got the lead up to three now for the Wizards. Got to go that time. And some good action for the first two. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show.